All right, 417 this morning. Jake, yeah. got some thunderstorms down in southwest Oklahoma. Uh, still watching those here this morning, tracking some severe weather, or make that uh, some, some heavy weather going on down that way. We tracked some storms yesterday. Boy, I was down at the chicken and pickle uh, right there on Broadway Extension. I uh, was there for a little event for uh, my, my rescue pup that I'm still trying to get adopted. I'm going to show a picture of her, by the way, because she's absolutely adorable and needs to get adopted. Uh, but that storm popped up, storm, and it didn't move. It dropped anchor, and it stayed right. There was no other storms in the whole metro except right there on top of us there at the Chicken and Pickle. But again, a few storms around. Jim Gardner was up. Also had Marty Logan out as well in northwest Oklahoma with a few storms up that way. But again, heavy rainfall. A little bit of wind out of those and a lot of lightning, which did cause the delays for the game yesterday evening. Let's go to the current view on radar right now. And we'll show you where those storms are right now. You can see them in parts of the Panhandle, southwest Oklahoma. Again, some of that rain is moving into the uh, far southwest part of the state right now. You see that there. It's a little heavy at times, but main story there with the lightning running right down along the Red River from south of Hollis, south of Altus and it's tracking to the south and east. This will be moving out of the state and weaken as we go through the morning hours. 64 right now, south winds at five miles per hour. Again, we're gonna be uh, pretty warm today. We'll call it hot, 87 is right on the edge of being very warm to hot. So you need to make sure you're prepared for that if you will be out and about. Do have another chance of a storm today, like we had last two, three days. It's gonna be that early mid-afternoon time frame. Storms will fire up. They'll be kind of popping up around through early evening, and they should start to diminish. And same kind of forecast again today, but chances overall are low. 20% chances again to 4 o'clock, again, again uh, middle upper 80s here on the way today. Uh, 60s out the door this morning. Got a few 70s out there too. 70 Tulsa, 72 in Durant. As we check your future cast here, overall chance of any rainfall you can see today is not great. There may be an isolated storm here and there. Best chance will be up here in northeast Oklahoma and also parts of parts, uh, parts of start far southwest parts of Oklahoma. And then you go overnight tonight, like we've had the last few nights, the rain will diminish. It'll start off dry, and then a few more will pop up going into tomorrow afternoon. We've got a few storms up in northeast Oklahoma that will try to back build down towards central Oklahoma. Right now, we'll keep the metro chances fairly low. And then a few storms will develop out in the Panhandle area. Those will try to move into northwest Oklahoma before more storms try to develop on Saturday. Here's the, the deal on Saturday. We'll have a little stronger jet stream overhead and a storm system kind of rolling across. And that might kick up some thunderstorms from Ponca, Stillwater, maybe near the metro. And those will all work to the south and east. We go into the afternoon. So they'll be, we'll call them scattered in nature. If you're underneath one of those, some severe weather will be possible. You saw the intensity and the colors there. Maybe a few bigger storms on Saturday. So make sure you're prepared. If you're going out to area lakes, make sure you're ready to go. Any storms that do develop could be severe, large hail, some damaging wind especially. That's what we have this time of the year. Right now, the tornado threat remains very, very low. And our forecast on Sunday, right now, looks mainly dry. We've got some 80s, some low 90s around here coming up for today. Again, chance of an afternoon shower thunderstorm today overall is low. Got some 60s overnight tonight. And as we go into tomorrow afternoon, again, some 80s, some low 90s around. Again, our chance of rain in the forecast as we go into Friday uh, will be best chance up here in northeast parts of Oklahoma. Uh, maybe a little stronger complex develops in the panhandle. We'll track that coming up late tomorrow. That may linger on into tomorrow night and Saturday. And some data has that moving down to the northwest part of st the state and approaching Oklahoma City tomorrow morning. That weekends, and then a few more storms try to develop Saturday afternoon and Saturday, Saturday afternoon and evening. So the best chance of severe weather, northwest Oklahoma, late Friday, early Saturday. And that will develop uh, Saturday afternoon and evening across parts of northern, central, into southern and east Oklahoma, and that will move away, and we'll see that move on out. But again, some rain chances possible here as we go through the next several days. Most days, chances overall are low. We'll pop those up to 60% for Saturday. Another chance comes in Sunday night, early Monday, and a few more chances going into Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. Otherwise, just a warm, seasonable forecast. Most days, highs up in the 80s. All right, Jay.